Hey guys, today I'll show you how to install an extra point to watch from Alex Honeycomb on your PC. Okay, first of all, uh, we need to grab two things off the internet. The first is the Android iOS image which you can get from www.android.x86.org and the second is a software called VirtualBox which you can get from VirtualBox.org. Uh, now, VirtualBox is basically PC emulation software which allows you to create and run virtual machines on top of our currently running desktop. Uh, why we need that? Yes, because using VirtualBox we can install any operating system on our PC without creating a dedicated partition for our operating system or making any changes to our boot record. Okay, so uh, once we have VirtualBox installed and running, this is what it will look like. So from here we need to click new, create a new virtual machine and click next. On the next screen, we need to uh, specify the name for our virtual machine. In my case, I just name it Honeycomb. And also we need to specify the type of operating system we are going to install on our virtual machine. In our case, we are installing Android, which is a Linux distribution, so I just select Linux. And I select error because Android isn't listed on the list of the Linux distributions. Click next. And on the next screen, we need to specify the amount of RAM we're going to assign to our virtual machine. I'll just select 512 because 512 is, I think, enough for Honeycomb. And click next. Now here we need to create a virtual hard disk for our virtual machine. Our virtual hard disk basically is the file that resides on our PC and acts as a hard disk for our virtual machine. Uh, so we'll just click next to start the new virtual hard disk setup wizard and click next. On the next screen, we need to make sure that dynamically expanded storage is selected and click next. And here we can name our virtual hard disk whatever we want. It is conveniently uh, named Honeycomb by default and the size is set to 8 GB. So I think both options are uh, fine. Just click next and click finish to uh, finish the uh, create new virtual hard disk setup user and finish again to finish the new virtual machine setup user. Now virtual machine is created, but there are a couple of more steps we need to take before we can start the Honeycomb installation on our virtual machine. First, we need to make sure that on the system tab in the setting dialog box. All these four checkboxes are unchecked. And the second is we need to load the ISO image of Honeycomb x 86 we just downloaded to our virtual machine so that, uh, so that we can boot from it. Ok, now we can start our virtual machine installation, just hit start to start the virtual machine. And on the first screen that appears, we need to select the last option installation to start the installation of Honeycomb. So we just created our uh, virtual hard disk, so it definitely has no partition on it. So to create one, we need to select create slash modify partitions. We'll select new, primary, select the whole size for uh, the hard disk, press enter, and to make it bootable, we select bootable and press enter. And finally, we'll select write to write all the changes we have made to our virtual hard disk. Uh, type yes for the confirmation and press enter. Once the partition is created, just select create and select our newly created partition for the uh, honeycomb installation. Format it uh, with ext3, press enter and yes. Once the formatting is complete, we need to select yes to uh, install the grab bootloader and then yes again. Now the installation is complete, but we need to take uh, one last step before we can start using our Honeycomb installation. We need to create a fake SD card. Uh, 
Press OK. Okay, once the fake SD card setup is complete, we need to remove the ISO image we have uh, loaded while installing and force unmount and then we reboot our machine. Now, if everything works well, we'll be able to boot into our uh, Honeycomb installation. So here we are guys, it ended through and through running on our PC and I hope you enjoyed the tutorial and see you later, take care.